Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to another This is the Police. So, last time we found, met the new guy, Mr. Varga. Uh, pretty much, from my understanding, he's another mobster. He's a drug dealer, from my understanding. And he's pretty much going to war with Mr. Sand, uh, who is another mobster. And we had to pick and choose, so I'm kind of excited with Sand, mostly for the reasoning of I feel like Mr. Sand is the... I guess, uh, typical old-school mobster who has appreciation for his city, while the other one doesn't give a shit if it burns. So, I feel like, you know, they're the best of... Mr. Sand's the best of both evils. So, let's get into Oven again. It's a nice song, but my, like, my frickin' luck, the... YouTube will demonetize me. I mean, I'm not getting monetized as it is, but I'm gonna... Okay, what's going on here? Let's call on the paddy wagon. Uh, call from a commander who said a brawl broke out involving over 20 men. Security are keeping back. Let's call on the SWAT and two officers. My luck today is going to be a SWAT day and I'm going to need to use these guys more often. Uh, let's see. How are we doing investigations? We got nothing. No gangs. Uh... Massive fight, the situation more serious, we're requesting reinforcements. Alright, send two more. Assault, uh, two teens walking their dog onto an argument. Eventually one just the dog on the other. Probably still one. A lot of officers out there right now. Who would have guessed in the first hour, lots of shit just goes on? I mean, I don't think this is the police chief's job to kind of order cops to go to places. How's this going? Oh, we're struggling on the ground, barely holding off the angry dog. He's trying to run by the throat, hit the dog. Um, hit the dog with the taser. The dog let the boy escape and its owner start to flee. Um... Or the kid the hall. Got him. Yep. I was gonna chase after him, but it, that would have ended badly, so order him the hall. Homicide. Oh, shit. Parishioner, parishioner uh, Maria Serpentine reported the sounds of gunshots inside the church. A bearded man with a hat entered the confessional. Uh, a few minutes. Uh, then a minute later, heard a few gunshots. The man calmly left the boot, took off his hat, and crossed himself. Sit down in the pew, and I think he's praying. That's lovely. How'd this go? Under caught, officer on arm, civilian on arm. Good. And I only got one more use out of these guys, so I really gotta weigh it. If it's bad, I'll send them. If it's not. But I can't. I really gotta get in point with this, because I can't go after Sans guys anymore. Even if it's by accident. I can't do it. Shit. What happened? Officer. Oh. Good God. Uh. We're going to the police station. Attempted murder. We're going to send these two. Uh, send three. So far, the Mafia hasn't asked to do nothing. Um. But we'll see. That that's gonna come up soon. It seems like every day the mafia has something going on. And how'd this go? The girl was injected with normal painkiller. God damn it! Just some psycho broad. So it looks like the Mafia doesn't want anything from me today. It's Ice Arena. An ice cream vendor notices a suspicious black bag. Unsupervised on the bench a few hours. Send the SWAT team. Fuck it, send them all. Anything that's involving sand, I definitely need to be on point with this. So, I'm not taking any risks. I have a feeling it's a bomb. 
because, I mean, now Sand and this other guy are at war, so we have to assume that these guys are going to be blowing each other up, and i got to take care of Sand best that I can. Officer. Officers arrived on scene, and there's, there's something moving inside the bag. Stay back until those bomb squad arrives. What's going on? All right, so we got the guy. But what was it? Okay. These guys can take... No, they're not. Oh, City Hall's a bunch of dicks. Oh, they're just a bag of dicks. <sighs> not a good day when you lose an officer. Eh, uh, Clara dead. She's been shot. Corn monument to be demolished by summer's end. City administration to finance dance festival. Francis Kendrick won't succeed Jack Boyd. Oh yeah, Kendrick I think is the dude that dipped. So yeah. Of course he fucking didn't, lazy bastard. Oh, I was I taking the trash last night? I accidentally got into some poison ivy. This morning I noticed my feet were blistering. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, take, take the day off. Um, let's promote her. I need more, you know, decent cops. Oh, yeah, let's do this one. Yeah. Oh, hello. Yep, there you go. Freeburg's first mafia war in decades has spread across, uh, spread chaos across the streets. Major criminal gangs vie for power. The outcome of the struggle is impossible to predict. One thing for certain, a couple weeks from now, only one family will rule the city. Yep. Alright, so let's see how this one. Yeah, keep up the good work and we'll make sure... Hey! Uh... Shift A, Shift B are pretty comparable. Uh, I'll throw the new guy on Shift A. Next time I get a spot open, I'll go for Shift B. Uh, passerby rang the police when he saw a naked man running through the streets, pursued a woman carrying a large kitchen knife. I'll gut you, you fucking... Oh, wow. Huh. Let's, uh, send two cops out. That, that's okay, not what I was expecting to do today. Um... Can I ask you dicks for anything? City center, San needs help. Varga stirred up some punks and they went in and attacked one of the family, right Barber, and... All right, attempted murder. An unknown vehicle struck the librarian at a pedestrian crossing and drove off. The victim was found dead on the scene. Let's send uh, these two. Oh, you know what? You're kind of tired. Let's send Moser. Ah, this guy. I think these, these. No, this was the crazy lady that was going after the naked guy. I don't know why the guy was naked. I don't know if I should be asking those questions, but for some reason he was naked. Uh, I guess this went okay. Oh. What do we got? So, the dark colored car comes tearing down the right corner, hopped the curb and kept going, knocked men over, didn't even slow down. Not long before the crash, I kicked a couple of drunks out of the bar. They were having a fight with some regulars. I don't know if that has anything to do. A few days ago, Dad had a fight with a couple of young people who were causing a ruckus at the library. Ah, uh, okay. I saw two people in the car. They went right by me. The man passed. Okay, so it sounds like this was like a revenge hit. Sans needs help. Mr. Sans' nephew. Uh, okay, so. Like how this guy has a lower like professional rate. Yeah, he's like a, hi a higher rank than this guy. Yeah, this guy's better. How does that happen? Th that sounds like a typical. Typical work environment. The guy with half the IQ has the most experience, apparently, but then the guy who's better... Uh, of course. 
Uh, oh, a girl entered Eddie's Burgers, ordered a Diet Coke, and starts shooting at the other customers with a handgun. The cashier called the police in the back room. Oh, wow, that's okay. Meanwhile, the crazed young woman shouting, I hate fat people. Wow, okay. Uh, yeah, let's just... Probably not smart to send everybody, but that's the only logical thing I can think of because if this crazy broad's got a gun, we need to make sure this shit ends now. Besides, I'll have one of my cops back on standby for sand if he needs help. I mean, my guys ain't getting back up. Oh, we got her, I think. Yep, we got her. Typically, I try to use the SWAT when they're when it's applicable. Um, if I think it's that serious, but the fact that the broad had a gun, I was like, yeah, yeah, SWAT's probably the best uh, option. So I got my whole staff on standby. Armed robbery. An alarm came uh, from an armed truck. The men have blocked the street. Oh wow, armed men have blocked the street. Shot out the armor. Oh wow, this is actually serious. Um, all right. So I really hope I'm not going to need these guys anymore. See how this went. They're probably gonna ask for backup. Yep. Okay, the narrow street is blocked by two vans near the armored car. Three men, masked men, have surrounded the truck, and one of them is carrying a blowtorch on the roof of the van. And the fourth criminal, who shouts something at, to his compliances as the as he sees the officers approach, shoot the robbers and stop in the van. You're surrounded. Surrender peacefully. The blowtorch won't work. You'll need you'll need to use dynamite. <laughs> okay, uh, surrender peacefully. Obviously, this is gonna you almost take out the robber. All right. Go on the offensive, take him out. Um, sweet! We got him! Uh, a night watchman during his rounds. Let's close this for now because I need my guys back. I, I have plenty of time to go after this. This is just a fight. I don't want to leave Scott on his own. I really would rather... Things are getting hasty. I want to make sure I've got cops on standby. All right. Night watchman during his rounds followed some noises to discover several homeless people fighting over a bundle. Over a bundle that was lying on the ground? Okay. Sent two cops. You know what? Uh, deputy. I want a police academy. Sure. Let's get her up. How the hit and run go? All right, so we got more. Uh, open investigation. I'm assuming it was some. Oh wait, there's more to it though. Oh, so I'm assuming that's how it went, but we still there's still one piece. It doesn't make sense yet. I was trying to raise ten. One started to pop up. God damn it! All right. Um. Like I said, I want to leave somebody on standby in case I need them for sand. Because, I mean, considering that now these gangs are at war, I'm going to need to take a side. That's the problem. We can't just start picking off both sides because there, there there's a power vacuum. Someone in the criminal underworld is going to try to take sand's spot. Oh, no officers are dead, so that's a good thing. Like I said, it's a good day when no cops are dead. Oh, hello. Jack Vargas is strong. Varga is strong, but he can't compete on equal terms with the oldest criminal gang of Freeburg. Just make sure that Sand stays ahead on points, and we'll have nothing to worry about. Okay. Huh. But yeah, I need more cops for this shift because we're losing cops on shift B.
Crime rate increased by 31%. Mayor's nephew expresses desire to become FPD. Ah, oh, that's cool. Uh, Freeburg Farmers report record harvest. Ah, oh, that's cool. And the shitty car again. I definitely need to hire more cops. We don't have enough people on the PD. Send two cops. No. Send those. Uh, stay pretty off. Send them. What's up with this? Mr. Boyd, I feel bad coming to you again, but you're really the only one I can. Those records. Uh, I, I don't care about this guy. I care more about sand. Send him. One of our minor deliveries got intercepted. I don't have I don't have spare spare, so you're screwed. Uh, send these two. I got all my guys because everything showed up all at once. And I mean, these guys are friggin' out caroling. Oh, I mean, I didn't have to do that, I guess. But I'm really just trying to keep everybody happy. But this dude ain't gonna be happy. So I mean, this guy it sucks to be this guy. All right, the police detachment arrived, seen, um, six criminals automatic, surrounded in a container, criminals spotted the police, two of them ready to rush to escape, ends in the air, the remaining criminals hiding inside the shipping container, surrounded, improvised a way to smoke them out, got them, yep. Oh. Ooh. Uh, let's bring that down to the station. I don't have any spare cops. Dude, you're on your own. 12-10 complete. Suspicious, suspicions were aroused by a shopping center wearing a costume from a movie dressed in blood. He was pretending to... Uh, really? Another fucking false alarm. God damn. I hate people. People come up with the dumbest ideas, really. Just waste police time. Can I make any... No, not yet. They probably checked this out already. Uh, I can't request any more cops. I, I need people. I seriously need fucking people. How are we looking? Yeah, Shift B is like missing a, de a guy. Alright, so that's the end of the day. Yeah, no cops dead. Sweet. And we're going to end the day. Sweet checkpoint. Mayor proves commitment to nepotism. Mayor Rogers, if my nephew wants to lead the police, I support him. Police chief, not elected position, says Mayor Rogers. That is true. It's not an elected position. You don't just get voted in. You, you get there because you kind of get hired. Uh, I was up in the real detective now, last temptation of Neptune. But I did have time I didn't have time to get the ending. I'm certainly a house cat, you know I simply cannot rest until I know for sure. Can I go home and finish? No! Why do you wanna no? Screw you and screw your book. No, I'm not letting you get the day off because you wanna friggin' Uh let's get this guy up. No, you're not getting the day off just because you want to read a book. Screw you. Read it on your lunch break. Uh, no. Clarinet sugar. All right. Let's see what this one's all about. All right. Damn it. Did these guys ever get back to me? I guess not. Well, neither of my cops are dead, so that's good. That's handled. We helped uh, Sands out. Bank of Freeburg. All right. Fatal casualty. Yeah, let's send the SWAT team. They're probably going to ask for backup. That's probably the end result here. If I got to call on the SWAT team, they're going to need backup. Um, I don't necessarily think with the SWAT team they're going to need backup. 
I'm not gonna. I'm gonna try not to send it because I feel like the SWAT team should be able to handle it. Uh, yeah, they're requesting uh, backup. Send Johnson. Just, yeah, I, I didn't want to. Just send Johnson. Oh shit. Okay. Then needs more help. I mean, I'm surprised that none of my cops are like, hey, so why is the chief sending us to help a mobster? Granted, like I said, that's probably the, he's probably, oh, wow. Oh, I just lost like half my friggin' shift. Oh, that fucking sucks. At least I, okay. I wonder, uh... That just hurts. Yep. Like I always say, it's a bad day if we lose cops, and we didn't just lose one cop, we lost four. Shit. God damn it. Oh. Yeah, how's this going? Open investigation, let's see. Wait a minute. Okay, so it was a dark colored. Okay, so wait, no, no, no. This doesn't make sense because it's a dark colored car. Why is it red? Uh, hopped the curb and kept on going. So that's true. There we go. Uh,. This one they're gonna have to wait. I'm hoping that these guys come back before end of day. Never mind, end of day. Well, she. Uh, oh, op open the investigation. Let's see. Uh, I'm gonna wait till we get more information on this before I start trying to come up with conclusions. And wrong place. Damn it. All right, well, we're ending the day. And all right, so Varga managed. Vargas managed to get uh, ahead a little bit, but Sands is holding in the line, which is good. We want to make sure he's staying ahead, so I'm trying to in invest as much as possible. Yeah, we're gonna declare him dead. Yep. Yep. Shit. Well, guys, that's where I'm going to have it, have to end it for today. Uh, you know what? Let me see if there's going to be cutscene. It's probably going to be cutscene, and then I'll end it. Yeah. All right, so now, okay, no cutscene. So, yeah, that's where I'm going to end it for today. I hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, hope you guys enjoyed the series as, uh, as much as I am. Please, as always, like, comment, subscribe, the whole shebang. And, as always, have a good one.